What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Darian, this is Jeremy, and we are DNJ React. React. Uh, this one's a brand new one. I've never even heard of her before, uh, but she was recommended highly in the comment section. So I figured we'd, you know, step out of our comfort zone and just see who this girl is. Her name is Olivia Rodrigo, and the song is called Brutal. And I'm doing a live performance because for, when I, when I watch brand new artists, I want to see them live first. Yeah. Before I see their music video and everything set up so perfectly, like I'd love to see them live to see who they really are. How, how they, they sound. And how they sound and yeah. how the crowd reacts to them. Like who are they? Is basically you get a good understanding of who they are, you know, when they're, when they're live and the pressure's on versus a scripted movie video and yeah. music video. A lot video. of those lip synced and stuff or a video. I don't know that it's lip synced, but. No, no, most of those are lip synced because they're doing sets and they're doing little pieces of it to put the video together. So typically it's lip sync to the audio. I gotcha, okay. Um, yeah, so we're gonna jump right into it. This is Olivia Rodrigo, brutal. I have no idea what kind of genre she is. No, no idea right. about anything about R Olivia Rodrigo. So I'm excited to see who she is. You guys have been recommending her like crazy. So let's jump right into it. About to learn. By Circus Circus. This is the um, that no, Las I don't Vegas event. So. You don't think so? The love? That's that's the sign, dude. There's Flamingo. And then that's uh, there's Caesar's Palace. So where the hell is this? This is across the street from uh, where that shooting happened a long time ago. Mandalay Bay. Mandalay it's... Bay. It looks yeah, like maybe. Mandalay Bay or Treasure Island. Oh. I don't know. Anyways. Mid 2000s, Flyleaf. Honestly, I didn't listen to too um, many girl bands back then. I was listening to like hardcore heavy metal back then. Damn. Guys, let me know who is. She sounds kind of like <clears throat> Flyleaf, or I forget the other girls. There's a couple other girls that have uh, similar styles like her. So it's got like a punk type thing. To yeah, it. it's like an emo it's punk type yeah. vibe. Yeah, it's good. <laughs>
gets her inspiration from? Because a lot of this stuff does sound like uh, early 2000s punk. Yeah, it does. Like Green Day. Yeah, and that's Panic what I was thinking too. Yep. Um, you know all like the bands. Like Misfits and stuff yeah, like that. Yeah, like yeah. Um, Flyleaf and... Bro, I can't remember the other girl bands that were like back in the day that were uh, really big. Avril Lavigne. Oh, Avril um, Lavigne. Damn, dude. Who I wasn't really into all that too much because I was into like really hardcore. But they were like mainstream. Back then. Oh, I know. They were really on the radio to, and shit. I mostly listened to like heavy metal, death metal type stuff back then. That was kind of my thing. I got to do some more research on Olivia Rodrigo, but, but all her stuff though. sounds like very similar to 2000s punk rock, which yeah. is like some of my favorite genres back yeah. in the day when I was in high school. Yeah, this, this is good, man. This was like a really good first introduction to Olivia Rodrigo. Yeah. I thought it was going to be more of like a soft... That's what I thought I too. Thought. Yeah, because they have the piano and all that stuff. So yeah. I was thinking like a soft, and it comes out like a punk rock. Yeah, this is dope, yeah. man. Trick me, man. She's so pretty. I, I thought it was gonna be like, um, who's the girl who dated um, Pete Davidson, Ariana Grande? Oh yeah. I thought it was like gonna that. be like very soft and girly and stuff. Yeah, and no, then, it was all this grunge kind grunge, of like punk, yeah, yeah. punk rock. That shit was good, man. Yeah, I dig that. Good recommendation, guys. Yeah, I like that one. Yeah. If you got any more like that? Definitely throw them in the comments. Yeah, Olivia Rodrigo. Definitely throw some more of her songs in the comments and and. Uh, more of like this genre. She probably, I'm sure she has some soft stuff too, but yeah, the punk rock shit is, yeah, is fire, cool. man. I like it. Um, guys, if you like this content, like, subscribe, uh, hit that bell notification, go over to our Patreon, sign up, and uh, vote for the next songs for the following week. Uh, you guys got some killer picks this last time, so keep them coming. We'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Peace.